So Rakate Yahawa, Rakate Yaw Shai, Rakate Yahawa, Rakate Yaw Shai, Rakate Yahawa, Rakate Yaw Shai. First and foremost, we want to give our praises and glory and honor to Yahawa, Bashem Yaw Shai, double honors to the apostles and elders who rule well at Great Millstone, and a blessed sanitation to the Akyams mm -hmm. in the four county yard who pushing the gospel in sincerity and truth, Shalom. This evening, I want to touch on um, this, uh, you know, these, these wacky ass Christians, you know, like to say that um, Mary and Joseph didn't have sex, you know, but this evening, I'm going to go to the scriptures and prove it by the scriptures that Mary and Joseph did have sex, right? Because you wacky ass Christian, you, everything that you do, you go after your feelings. And the lies that you learn all these years, you know, that Christianity teach that uh, Mary was a virgin, or the angels, uh, so like the angel had sex with Mary, but according to the scripture, angels don't carry seed, right? So we're going to prove that too, right? And the scripture also say that Yahweh shall can come out of the lines of who? Yahweh shall with the world like God Jesus can come out of the line of who? David right and joseph 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 was mary husband and joseph and mary did have sex and joseph did come on the line of david right he was from the house of house of david from the family from the tree line the family line the family lineage right so we can prove it through the scriptures right and the heavenly father yeah the heavenly father is not to manage the lie so we can just get some precept in order to edify the church of Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai, the elect, the 144,000, the one third men and children, which is you so-called Negroes, Latins, and Native American Indian. Because only elect going to get this understanding. The rest of you two third going to be destroyed, right? Along with the heathens, right? So this is only for the elect, right? This is um, Psalms 119, right? Yeah, some quick precept Psalms on 19 all right yeah this is Psalms on 19 verse 104 he said true thy precept I get understanding so true the most I precept you get understanding that's why the script is why he said saw the scriptures you gotta source these scriptures right he said through thy precept I get understanding, therefore I hate every false way. What's one of the false way? That Mary and Joseph did not sex. That's a false way. Right? The word virgin also means a young woman of a marriageable age. Right? The word virgin also means young woman too. Right? So you people teaching a false way, saying that the angel had sex with Mary, and angel can't the scriptures in Matthew 29. No, Salakia, Matthew chapter 22, verse 29 to 30. Angels don't carry seed. They don't have sex. Right? They don't carry seed. And the word marriage day, in, in that in the chapter and for us, the word marriage day go back to sex because marriage is sex. Right? And we're going to prove that too. Truth, right? And the Mosai is not a man that he should lie. Right? If the Mosai says something, this is what going to happen. This is what going to happen. Right, the most is not a mind that he should lie. Right? Uh so I think it's twenty-three. Leviticus twenty no no Numbers twenty-three. Um numbers twenty-three and nineteen, I think. Let me see, numbers twenty-three. Right. Yeah, this is numbers chapter twenty-three verse nineteen. He said uh he said the Mosai is not a man that he should lie, neither the son of man that he should repent. Had he said, and shall he not do it? Or had he spoken, and it shall and shall he not make it good? So the Mosai is not a man that he should lie, and his son is not a man that he should repent, so that don't lie. So we get on to this lesson, right? To edify the church of Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shai. Right? So the most I said of this man's seed, right, which which Joseph came out of the house of who, right, the house of David, and we can we can start off with Acts, right, to get the understanding that Mary and Joseph did have sex, right. Um, this is Acts chapter thirteen, start at verse twenty-two, right. 
this is Acts chapter 13 verse um, 22 he said and when he had removed him he raised up unto, unto them David to be their king to whom also he gave testimony and said I have found David the son of Jesse a man after my own heart which shall fulfill all my will all his will right 423 of this man's seed had the Mosai according to his promise rise unto Israel a savior Yahweh Shai because this word Jesus is not a is is, is not a is not an English word and in back in the and back in the ancient time there's two two languages that the Israelites used to speak right they used to speak the speak the speak hebrew and the speak greek because that the israelites was, was living among the greeks right so the speak hebrew and the speak greek so this word jesus is not even a, is not is not even a word right and in the greek and jesus can be it'll be jesus jesus right in the greek can be jesus so there's not even a greek there's not even a greek word eh? right and the word Jesus that does mean savior, right? And if it if you say it translated Jesus into from from Hebrew into the English, it's supposed to be He save, and not Jesus, right? So that's a little that's a little um, edification day, right? Charles G twenty four twenty four, Jesus, 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 Jesus is his name, right? This is Greek, this is Greek name, right? And there's not his name. This, this is just his name is Yahweh Shai, right? So he said, um, back to Acts 13 and um, 23, he said, This man's seed had the power according to his promise, rise up unto Israel his savior, right? Yahweh Shai of this man's seed. And Joseph, Joseph was of was of was from the lineage of, of the of David. And we can prove that, right? Because Yahweh Shai come out of the lines. Yahweh Shai who the world in call Jesus came out of the lines of Joseph, right? And we can prove it too. Right? This is Luke chapter 2, verse 4. Right? This is Luke chapter 2, verse 4. He said, And Joseph also went up from Galilee out of the city of Nazareth into Judea unto the city of David, which is called Bethlehem, because he, Joseph, was of the house and lineage of David. So he was the house and lineage of David. So keep this word in line, lineage, right? Keep this word lineage in line. We go into this word lineage, right? Right. So he was from the he was from the root of David, right? From the family tree, right? So the, the most I say of this man's seed, he rise up a savior, which is Yahweh Shai. So Yahweh Shai came out of the, the seed, the lineage right from the house of david which is joseph right the greek word is um strong's g 3965 patria 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 right this patria is the greek word for lineage right he said lineage running back to something um progenitor ancestry a nation or a tribe a group a group of family all those who in a given people lay claim to a common origin they said the Israelite which distribute into 12 tribes descended from the 12 son of Jacob these were divided into the family which were divided into houses right so he's from the house of David right so keep that in mind the, the word lineage right all right so we go to um, go back to the word look Right, so lineage, right? So we go back to we can go back to um we can go back to Acts chapter thirteen, right? Acts chapter thirteen, verse twenty-two. And we go into the word seed, right? Acts chapter thirteen, verse twenty-three. So of this man's seed had the Mosai, according to his promise, rise up unto Israel his savior, Yahweh Shai. Right, so we go into this word seed. Right, we go into the word seed. Right, progeny. Right, 
and should we go into this word seed um right so the word seed they see the greek word is sperma sperma is the greek word there eh? right um so we come down it said the same it said the the product the product of his of his sema seed children of spring progeny right the word progeny there right so we go into the word progeny right this word progeny Car progeny progeny go back to what lineage right so we go into the word progeny right there's the word there, progeny progeny right it means a descendant or a descendant of a person animal or plant or spring right click on more and we go down right it's a descendant successor here stock lineage right so yahweh came out from joseph he came from the seed of joseph right and we can prove it more in the scriptures right we can prove it more in the scriptures right so we go back to we can go to um, romans right you know you walk you ask question don't read you know you don't have the spirit of yahweh bashim yahweh shai and a lot of you christians you are proud right the things that yahweh was taught in, in those harlot houses you know those, those um theology school is, is was a lie and you, and you learn and where it was taught it was taught by an enemy the so-called white man is the enemy so he taught you lies all he could do is lie right this is romans chapter 1 verse 3 it said concerning his son yahweh shaya mashiach our lord which was made of the seed of david according to the flesh the seed of david was the seed right going to the word seed right remember joseph came out of the lineage of david right so we go into the word seed right go back to our sperma right same thing sperma right strong's g 4690 yeah sperma 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 yeah the product of the pro, product of this seam semen seed children of spring progeny right she was of the, he came from the man's seed the man carried the seed some marriage did had sex because he came from a seed right and the the, the jews back then the israelites right Judah, Benjamin, and Levi, they know, right? They know, we can prove it to the, the scripture too. They know that he came from Joseph was the father. Can they say it, right? They say it. This is John 6 and 41. They say it, right? This is John chapter 6, verse 41. He said, the Jews, right? Let's go back to Judah, Benjamin, and Levi, right? The Jews then murmur at him because he said i am the bread which came down from heaven verse 42 and they said is not this yahweh shai the son of joseph the son of joseph whose father and mother we know how is then that he said i came down from heaven right so the the the, the, the israelites back then they know they know that mary and joseph did have sex it's just you wacky ass Christian, you know, you know, um, swallow up all these lies. And now, now when the, now when the truth out, you rejecting it because you swallow up all these lies, right? But Mary and Joseph did have sex, right? And we can prove it more through the scriptures, right? We can get Galatians 4 and 4, that did have sex, right? This is, um, like I say, it's only the elect... It's only elect can get this, right? The elect of the nation of Israel, the 144,000 men, women, and children. It's only they can get this, right? It's Galatians 4 and 4. This is Galatians chapter 4, verse 4. But the what he said, but when the fullness of the time was come, the Mosai sent forth his son, made of a woman, made under the law. Made of a woman, made under the law. Read this again. Galatians chapter 4 verse 4 but when the fullness of time was come the most I sent for the son made of a woman made under the law so let me see what the law say right when a woman conceives seed 
let me see what the law say right let me go to the law leviticus 12 right let me go to the law this is leviticus chapter 12 verse 1 he said and the lord speak unto moses saying speak unto the children of israel you so called negroes latins and native american indians saying if a if a woman have conceived seed and born a man born a man child yahweh was a man child right who the world is going to call jesus he was a man child right then then she shall be unclean seven days according to the days of the separation for her infirmity she shall be unclean right he said and in the eighth day the flesh of his foreskin shall be circumcised verse 4 and she shall be and she shall then co continue in the blood of our purifying three and thirty days which is 33 days plus seven equal to 40 days she gonna be unclean for and she shall touch no hollow thing nor come into the sanctuary until the days of our purif pur purifying be fulfilled right so this is the law when a woman conceive a man child so let's see if mary keep these laws because according to the scriptures angels don't have sex right and we're gonna prove it too right so we can go to luke and we can show that mary keep these same laws right she do these same things when she conceive Yahweh Shai was circumcised on the eighth day, right? This is Luke chapter 2, right? I mean, start of verse 21. All right, this is Luke chapter 2, verse 21. And when it said, yeah, it said, and when the eighth day were accomplished for the circumcision of the child, his name was called Yahweh Shai, which was so name of the angel before he was conceived in the womb right before he was conceived in the womb i can only conceive when a man plant a seed how a man plant a seed when he put you right up in a woman that's how a woman gonna conceive when he plant his seed right and angels do not carry seed angels do not have sex right angel do not marry right you see Four twenty-two, and when the days of our purification according to the law galatians 4 4 and leviticus chapter 12 1 to 4 according to the law of moses were accomplished she brought him to jerusalem to pre to present him to the lord all right and this can and this can't the law right he said as it is written in the law of the lord every male that opened the womb shall be called holy to the lord the hour so the first the firstborn child for a woman, when the when the child opened the womb, the, the child be the child separate and holy unto the Lord. So all these firstborn male separate and holy unto the Lord, right? This this in the law, right? So Mary did circumcise Yahweh Shai, right? According to the law, right? According to the law, she did circumcise him. According to the law, right? So it clearly showed that Mary and Joseph did had sex. Right, so we go to the one with the angel and show that angels do not have sex. Right, and show that angels do not have sex. I can't the scriptures. Right, this is um 22, start at 29. Right, let me get this. Um, right, this is um, this is Matthew chapter 22, verse 29. He said, Yahweh Shai answered and said unto them, He do err, you so called wacky, you um, salaka, you wacky ass Christian, do err. Right? Uh, Matthew chapter 22, verse 29. Yahweh Shai answered and said unto them, He do err, not knowing the scriptures nor the power of the Mosai. For in resurrection they neither marry nor given into marriage, but are as the angel of the Mosai in heaven. So the word marriage go back to sex. Right, this is the um, Donovan Compact Bible Dictionary. Uh, we can go to the word marriage, right? We can get the word marriage, right? You know, this, right? This is um, Donovan Compact Bible Dictionary, and this is page three, four, five, right? And this is the word marriage, right? It says marriage is an intimate personal union to which a man and a woman consent, consummate and nourishing by sexual intercourse 
so sex is marriage that's how when a man and woman is married by sex so the angel in heaven do not carry seeds they do not carry seeds the scripture clearly said they don't marry they don't give into marriage they don't carry seeds so the angel and mary didn't have no sex it's joseph and mary did had sex right joseph and mary did have sex right and we can close off with this one eh? let me get this one um in the apocrypha right let me get this one in the apocrypha all right let me get this one in the apocrypha where's the Messiah one just a minute yes Uh, this is my Solomon. All right, this is my Solomon seven. All right, one, two. One to six, right? So you get this pull up quick. Let me show this is um this is what this this is what this is what the Lord say, right? This is what your say, right? This is what we see, right? So we get this here, right? This is a straight cut too. Um this is um Oh boy, let me see. This is the King James. Uh, just a minute. And let's put in K KGV. Alright, KG. KGV. Alright, KGV. Alright. <clears throat> Yeah, so this is um Wisdom of Solomon, right? Seven from one to six he said he said I he said I myself am a mortal man like to all and the offspring of him that was first made of the earth. And this is this is Yahweh Shai, who the world in the call Jesus speaking, right? He said, and in my mother's womb was fashioned to be to be flesh in the time of ten months, being come back in blood of the seed of man, of the seed of man. <laughs> this is a straight cut. He said, and the pleasure that came with sleep, the sex, pleasure that came with sleep. Right? He said, verse 3, and when I was born, I drew in the common air and fell upon the earth, which is of like nature. And the fourth voice which I utter was crying, as others do, I was nourished and swallowing in cloth, and that with care, for there is no king. Our Lord and Savior Yahweh Shai is, a, is, the, is the King of kings and Lord of Lord. He said, For there is no king that had any other beginning of birth. No king. Everything come to sex. Birth come to sex. Right, read this again, verse 6, wisdom of Solomon 7 and 6, For there is no king that had any other beginning of birth, for all men have one entrance into life, and the light going out. All men have one entrance into life, and the light going out. Yahweh Shai wasn't crucified on the cross, he didn't die. There's a straight cut for you, wacky ass Christian. You know, and with that, hope this lesson was edifying. Want to give all praises and glory and honor to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh Shai, double honors to the apostles and elders who rule well at Great Millstone, and a blessed salutation to the Akyams in the four candy to pushing the gospel and sincerity and truth. Shalom.